Presenting the 2021 budget statement in Parliament on March 12th, Majority Leader Osei Chairman Sambonso says funds generated from road tolls will be used to support road projects. According to him, the COVID-19 pandemic has had a toll on the country's income, hence the need for tolls to be increased. To maintain the improvement on our roads, government will review existing road tolls and align them with current market rates. This will form part of the framework for promoting burden sharing as we seek to transform our roads and infrastructure, infrastructure sector in a post-COVID era. Mr. Speaker, furthermore, in 2021, we will amend the fees and charges miscellaneous provisions act 2018 that governs the setting of rates and tolls to accommodate an automatic annual adjustment that will be pegged to previous year's average annual inflation as published by the Ghana Statistical Service. Mr. Chairman Sambonso outlined a number of road and bridge projects government will continue in 2021. Speaker, the Accra inner city roads, about 84 kilometers, the Kumasi inner city roads, 100 kilometers, the Tamale interchange project, which is about 60% uh, complete, the PTC roundabout interchange project, Takradi, Adenta Dodua Dual Carriageway, the Sunyani Inner City Roads, 39 kilometers, Western Region and Cape Coast Inner City Roads, 32.19 kilometers, upgrading of selected feed roads in the Shanti and Western Regions, construction of Hohoi Jassikai Dodi Pepesu Road, 66.4% uh, kilometers which is 32% complete now. Construction of bridge over the Volta River at Volivo. Construction of the Swami Interchange will be done. Rehabilitation of the Tatali Zabzugu Yendi Tamale Road, 165.8 kilometers. Speaker will be undertaking. Rehabilitation of the Zabzugu Nakali Bimbila Road, 73.6 kilometers will be done. The rehabilitation of the Dome Kitasi Road, 19.5 kilometers. Design and construction of the Buipe, Yape, and Daboya bridges. The three bridges will be constructed.